drive there and do it myself or however we have to do it. And Dale, I'll never forget, we were sitting in a meeting and my mom's sitting there and she's saying, we can do this, but I don't know if it's going to be done by Christmas. And Dale says, I mean, we, we're going to do it by Christmas. We're going to drive down there. And the next weekend, we were supposed to drive down here and there was a big snow. And he said, well, we'll just wait, we'll just wait. And then, you know, the, the supplies weren't coming quick enough. And I was like, we just got to keep doing this. We just keep got to keep going. And we had all this help. And people just started going on Facebook and here and there and everywhere. And, and then 84 Lumber came through. And I said, all right, we have two days to get people in order. And our wonderful guys and Sydney and Al and, and Christopher and these kids took off school and they all just said, let's go. And they all want to stay and they have to go back to work. But, I mean, I'm almost positive some of them probably will fight me to the next Tuesday. And these wonderful volunteers from this area, we were welcome here and they treated us like family. And we want to thank you guys so very much. And I'm so glad we were able to do this for you guys. And if you need anything else, anything at all for Waylon or for your family, um, just let us know. We're willing to help and do whatever we can. I mean, we can come back here. Some dreams come true, and I believe it. You can prove it. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, you know. 